well, I hear somebody talking, but uh, here's uh, Jim Parsons, Big Bang Theory, Hello. best actors. Thank you. Uh, you know, congratulations. Thank, thank you very much. I mean, really, it's not much of a show after that, is it? <clears throat> anyway. Thank you. Hi. Hello, I'm good. Hey, Jim Samberg, we're right in front of Hello. you. Hello. I'm very good. Thank you. you. Thank you. Uh, what did uh, Cammie say to you? I think she just said she loved me. I don't know. It was awkward to hug in front of so many people. But um, yeah, I think she just said she loved me. Uh, it was really stunning to be up there with her. It was really kind of hard to fathom that this was actually happening. Yes. Uh, as soon as she opened the envelope, I could tell the way she moved or whatever, <laughs> the, the, vo the noise that came out of her mouth, I could tell. Over here? Yes. Hey. How are you doing? Good. Obviously, you knew this was a special role from day one, but did you ever, did you get the vibe back then that it would be so specific and distinct that it would bring you such awards? No, no. I didn't even know we'd stay on the air. Um, no. Uh, but I did connect with it in a way that was pretty specific. I will say that, you know, then that doesn't happen as an actor. I don't feel like that happens that often. You know, you play a lot of roles that you're like, I can do this and it's fine and it's good even. But um, there was something from the moment I read this one. But as far as carrying on into something that's gone on this long and like you say, to bring an award, no, I had no idea. Um, I'm still surprised. Hi, Jim. Oh. Hey, hello. Hi, o over here. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that's okay. Oh, um, hi. <laughs> after winning an Emmy and, and following that up with a Golden Globe, do you feel uh, any, any type of pressure put upon you now as you go forward to act again in the series or any personal pressure? No, I don't. I don't. Uh, or at least I'll try not to, you know. If there was going to be pressure, I would imagine it would be later on, you know. Um, but I don't. It's been, you know, to work in general has been a blessing. But, you know, these events like the Emmys, like the Golden Globes, are what a, what a special thing to get to, to go to and be a part of. And, and it's really, you know, it's really such a cherry on top of just the fact that you get to keep doing your job at all. Um, so in that respect, if I can maintain that type of attitude towards it, then no, I don't think it adds pressure. It's just, you know, try and enjoy the moment as much as possible and, um, and appreciate what's happening. Jim, yes. over here, Jim. Sorry. Yes. This is from one of your fans at HF Create Twitter. Uh-huh. Uh, do you have an inspiration for your role? Um, uh, dull as it may sound, the writing, you know, I, um, I've been asked before, do you have anybody you've based the role on or whatever, and I didn't. Um, I've thought of people that I've known who were very smart that I didn't understand when I was in school um, that were different and, and obviously special. And, um, but, but, but no, everything, everything I've ever gotten for this role, anything I've done for this role has come very specifically from what they write. And, um, and that's why I, I'm so eager to thank them in a moment like this, because just, I literally have nothing to provide without that, you know. Last question. Yes. Um, Hello. People always talk about your physical comedy. So mm -hmm. when you see a script, are you almost choreographing some of those crazy moves? And, and are, you, are you like that in life? We know you're not a scientist. Right. Are you, oh, well, that's the word. <sighs> A funny mover. Um, I, I do tend to be an awkward mover in real life, is what's funny, is I have my hand on my head like that. Who does that? Um, the only thing I would say, I don't, I don't specifically choreograph anything, but I have been, from a very young age, I've been a, a, a pacer and a memorizer. And for this, as I memorize lines, and for this show very specifically, I will be down in my bedroom and um, walking around and I will find myself doing things. And maybe there's something I've done in those moments that I've held on to, but I, I, I have to tell you a lot of it's really created in the moment in rehearsal. Um, uh, and sometimes in performance when you, God hope, inspiration hits because it's not working. Uh, but, um, but really it's, it's right then and there and not so much too set in stone. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. Kim. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you all. Hi again. Can I go this way? Or do I go?